Hey, good morning everybody. Another beautiful day in Montenegro. This time we are in Prokletie mountains here on the border with Albania. And this is Grebaje Valley. And behind me you can already see the mountains, the accursed mountains. And we are here waiting for the sun to come to light up the peaks. Unfortunately, there is no clouds today, but uh, we found some solution and there's actually some pond here in the meadow and we're going to look for reflections. So hopefully this will work for us. And uh, today we have a big day ahead of us. We want to hike up the, uh, the mountains here to this side of the mountain. Whoop, maybe you can see. Yeah behind this mountain here behind me and then there's a beautiful beautiful grassy ridge that we can hike along and have beautiful views on the mountains behind so this is one of the most beautiful views in montenegro and uh, this is our plan for later today So we walked a little further into the valley here at Grebaja and we discovered this must be just temporary lake and it's much 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 better reflection here so we are photographing this end of the valley and the reflections and the sun hitting the mountains is really great it's lighting up it's great in contrast so this is a beautiful shot we don't really see the same peaks anymore or, or at least they are not in the same lineup or how should I say so not the highest mountain is in front of us so this is a little bit of the downside but anyway it, what it matters is the aesthetic view right not the names or the heights of the mountains here so I'm really happy with this and we are already discussing to come here for sunrise tomorrow if we can make it because we'll be really really late back from the mountain anyways just beautiful beautiful morning we only hear birds nothing else no other people oh and we discovered biggest the fattest garden snail I've ever seen in my life I mean it's huge I need to show you this one hey Josh can you toss me that snail so yeah look at this big fat snail I, he looks quite old too from the layers on his house here that's something unusual I haven't seen it like this so it must be really really old ancient snail maybe hundreds of years old. He could tell stories from Prokletie mountains. It's early afternoon. It's blazingly hot. And we are hiking up to Popadia plateau or a ridge. This is a grassy ridge about 2100 meters high above the sea level. And it offers amazing, amazing views on this Prokletie massif more specifically on the Karamfili peaks. So when I was doing research for Prokletia, this was the view I was the most amazed with. So we just came out of the forest. We are probably more than halfway through. And now we are walking this beautiful mountain meadow full of wildflowers. There's this nice alpine spring flowing down it's probably drinkable water and we can already see the ridge first we decided to go to Volushnica ridge which is one of the uh, shorter ones well at least shorter to get to and then we're gonna walk up along the ridge towards Talianka 
which I think is the highest one on this trail. So down in the distance you can see where we started, you can see the restaurant, the car park, this is the Grebaja Valley and this is the end of it, we call it the trap in Slovenian, I don't know the English word, and let's go up, this is now the Prokletie mountains, the accursed mountains and these are the Karanfili peaks, Karanfil means a carnation flower beautiful name for beautiful mountains. Right, we are now on the top of Talianka Peak, which is in Albania. Here you can see behind me the flag of Albania, which is on the top. And this is probably the best viewpoint you can imagine here on this ridge. And we are seeing here all green ridge, the trail on the top, and then the views towards Karanfili, this beautiful mountain massif in this uh, Montenegrin side of Prokletie or the Accursed Mountains. So this is Popadia Peak. You see the beautiful rich green grass leading towards it and then views into Albania. And here I think we can get really nice telephoto shots of the layers of the mountains lining up later when the sun is lower down. It looks really promising. And here we are going back towards Prokletie, towards Montenegrin side. And we can see the Karanfili and the peak where we are, Talianka, with the Albanian flag. sun faded away, it set behind Montenegrin mountains on the west and right now we have some free time to enjoy without photography and it's still so beautiful you know these amazing mountains really tranquil uh, conditions there's not too much wind unfortunately there are no clouds in the sky but we used our day really well we had a lot of photo opportunities walking up this hike was not technically difficult, it was not physically difficult, but it was super hot. So uh, here we are waiting for blue hour and what we want to do is to do some set scenes for photography. We want to pose for each other with headlamps walking on the ridge and these dark mountains like a night shot uh, in the background. We'll see how this works. We still have about 20 minutes, maybe half an hour of time before the ambient light fades away and we can do that. So in the meantime, I'm just gonna sit down, enjoy the scenery, soak up the views because we are heading back down 
and uh, tomorrow it's more or less driving day to other parts of Montenegro. I have a very important thing to do right now. I have to teach Yaka how to yodel. So Yaka, let's go like this. Tri gole riti. Tri gole riti. Yeah. So now you have to do tri gole riti. Oh, fuck. Come on. Tri gole riti. Very good. This is yodeling. <laughs> Yeah, 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 yeah.